Hi guys, it's Teddy here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to do a trick by Dynamo. It's a very good trick. I'm going to be showing you the performance of it, and then I'm going to be showing you how to do it. Okay, so we'll turn over the top card, and the top card will be your card. Your card is a seven of diamonds. Over here I have my sharpie, as it, you can see, and we're just going to write anything, okay? So we'll just put your card, okay? So as you can see, it says your card, all right? And what we'll do is we'll just take your card and we'll place it over here, okay? And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take this card box and I'll place it on top. Right. Now the next card on top of the deck, the next card is going to be my card, right? So this card is the Ten of Hearts, okay? So I'll just write... Teddy. Okay, Teddy on that one. So here I have my card, and there is your card, alright, but if we snap, I now have your, your card, so that must mean that under here is my card. Alright, so this is the setup for Dunway's trip. You're going to want to practice writing your name out a lot of times and trying to get them the exact same because you're going to need three cards, okay, one random card which is the eight of hearts which will be their card and two five of diamonds. Now the reason that you want to practice writing out your name a lot is because you want to write it on here. So try and get it the same, so we'll just write Teddy, which is my name if you didn't know. Okay, so we'll just write Teddy right there, and you need to do this for the setup. And the setup is, you have the signed, your signed card on the top, their card in the middle, and the double, which isn't signed, on the bottom okay so on the deck like this and then you have your setup and you also want to have a sharpie to do this trick okay so now let's learn how to perform it so once you have your setup with your pre-signed card which will be your card on the top then which will then the card which will be theirs and then a double of your card but isn't signed okay so once you have this ready you can go up to some people ask them to show if you can show them a trick most of the time they're going to say yeah so don't worry okay then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to get a break beneath the top two cards if you don't know how to get a break or perform a double lift then click the link on the screen and it'll take you to a tutorial taught by myself so you'll take the, what they think is one card, but you'll turn it over as two cards. You turn it over and say, okay, so this card is your card. And you ask them to sign it. They can sign it. Uh, as many people can sign it, okay? So let's just say their name is Bob. Okay? We'll write Bob on there. So that now it's sign the case of their card. You're going to flip it back over again, showing it as though it's one card. So flip it back over. And then what they think is their card is really your card. Okay. Your pre sign card you're going to you can perform it like dynamo. You can put it in their hand, put their other hand on there, put it in their hand and get somebody else's hand on top of it. Your choice. Okay, perform it how you want. Be creative. 
And then you're going to do another double lift. Okay, you're going to flip it over. So that this is now my card. Okay, this will be the magician's card. So you're going to write Teddy as, you're going to write your name as similar as you can to like this, okay? Try and get it as accurate as you can. So, it's not always going to be 100%, but as long as you get it in the same position, if you're going to put a dot at the end, do a dot at the end, just things like that. So you're going to flip it over as though it's one card, when it's really two. You're going to take what they think is your card, but it's really their card, okay? And you're just going to place it on your hand, whatever you want to do. Place the rest of the deck in your pocket. I suggest in your back pocket if you have one, but I don't, so just get rid of the rest of the deck, basically. So what they think is their card right there is really here. And my card isn't here, it's really there, okay? But they don't know that. So you can do a snap, flip it over, you show them that their card is now in my hand. So that they flip this over and it's my card in their hand. So that's how to do it. It's done this trick. Practice it, don't perform it, and uh, hope you enjoyed it. Please comment, like, and subscribe. And check out more dynamic tricks revealed on my channel. So thank you for watching and goodbye.